Hi, my name is Keisha and welcome to my channel. Please like and subscribe and help me to grow my channel. Today, we're gonna be doing a review on the Louis Vuitton Speedy 30. So let's go ahead and get started. So as today's supermodel, I have picked my beautiful Damier Abin Bandelier style Speedy 30 for this video. So here she is. And the Speedy 30 is known as a Speedy 30 because it's 30 centimeters across, which is about 11.8 inches across. In height, she is about 8.3 inches tall. And in the width, she is 6.7 inches wide. So she's a nice sized handbag. You can definitely hold a lot of items in here, okay? The Speedy came out in about 1930. So that is about, let's see, um, 92 years. So this bag has been around for quite some time and I don't see it going anywhere. I know a lot of people, sometimes they're like, oh, the, the Speedy is basic or it's no longer relevant. It absolutely is relevant. There's many bags that have come and gone and this bag is still around. <laughs> right now in the USA, this bag retails for $18.90. And I know there's been so many price increases, but do I think it's still worth it? I absolutely think this handbag is still worth it. Now, this one that I'm showing you today is in the Damier Abin canvas. And Damier Abin is the first canvas that Louis Vuitton made. So this is the original canvas. The LV canvas came afterwards. And I've always loved this canvas and I loved epi leather. And it wasn't until I would say maybe the last 10 years that I really <laughs> started loving the monogram LV canvas. But I have absolutely always like loved this gorgeous brown canvas with the brown leather trim. Now today our model has on a pastille bag charm and this bag charm, they no longer make it, but it's absolutely stunning and you can purchase it on the resale market. I got like the brown tones, but they did have with other different colors for the little um, charms that are on it. And then I used a pochette key extender. So I only use this for decorative purposes or sometimes I use it on my pochettes for decoration. But here she is. And what bandolier means is with strap. So in 2011, they, they added this awesome feature to the speedies and now they give you the option of wearing a shoulder strap which i think is awesome in 1930 the original classic speedy did not come with a strap so i have the option of either wearing this gorgeous handbag in the crook of my arm or i can hand carry or i can add that shoulder strap on which we'll do shortly so let's go ahead first and take a look at the inside of this bag. Now this bag does have a double zip and I don't ever add the lock on until I'm ready to wear it because I noticed the locks that they give you with the Speedy always seems to tarnish rather quickly. So I always polish it up right before I use my Speedies. Now the interior of the bag is a red textile, okay? And the original textile that they used or microfiber was like a terracotta orange color. But recently over the years, they, they changed it to this gorgeous red interior. And the newer Speedies do have a zippered pocket. So you have one zippered pocket. The older styles just had a slip pocket without the zipper on the interior of a Speedy. Okay. 
so. This is her side view. I never use a bag organizer. I am totally okay with the bag sag. I think I have enough pouches and wallets to just put in here to keep organization and everything tucked away. So I'm okay with all the sagging it does. I like it, especially when I'm wearing this handbag crossbody. I kind of feel like the bag organizer, I know some people love it and rely on it for everything, but I don't like adding it to my handbag. So let's go ahead and we're gonna add the strap. So let me go ahead and show you the strap for the Speedy. It is a three piece strap, okay? It is adjustable and it is removable. So let's go ahead and add her on and see how she looks on the shoulder as well as crossbody. So first, we will put her on for crossbody and I'll just lower the camera so you can see. Now, I'm about 5'4 and I absolutely love how this handbag looks when it is crossbody. I know a lot of people feel like it's too large, but I absolutely love it. So that's how she looks. When no organizer, I think it just molds right to your body and it looks very nice. Now for a long shoulder bag, it is gonna be like right hitting on your lip, hip and a little bit below. So I absolutely love how it molds to the body and I love this style of handbag. Now, I have never <laughs> taken out that middle piece, but for today's video, we're gonna do it together and see how it looks with a shorter strap. Usually after I adjust my strap to the length that I like, I always just leave it that way and put it inside my bag when it's not in use. So, we're gonna do it today and see how it looks. And now if you would like to take out the centerpiece, I guess this gives you more options and more, you know, an extra look for your bag. So I took out that middle, that third piece. And of course you can see that the strap length is much shorter and let's see how it looks. And it is absolutely adorable i i love it i think it's a good size feels good enough room and it looks good so there she is i'm gonna go ahead and put back in that third piece so it's three pieces that are completely adjustable so you can definitely find the right size that's good for your body frame. So if you guys would like me to do any more reviews on the handbags that I've shown you so far, please go ahead and let me know in the comments. And I'm gonna try to do more reviews on the handbag so you can actually see, you know, what the interior, exterior, the size, and the current retail price of the bag if they are still available. So this Speedy 30 is 1890 in the USA, as I said, and they do have other sizes. This bag is offered in size 25. It's offered in the size 30, which is this size with the bandolier, size 35 and size 40. Now they also offer it in those sizes in the classic style without the strap. But this one is with strap, it's the bandolier style. So you do have a lot of options, not to mention they do have now the Nano Speedy as well as the Speedy 20. So you do have many different options in the canvas as well as in the leather like on prompt leather. 
styles. So the prices would be different than the canvas. But here she is and she's absolutely beautiful. And I highly recommend this bag, even though the price has increased, I still believe that it's a good value. And this is a bag that's timeless and iconic and it's not gonna go out of style anytime soon. <laughs> so I definitely recommend this handbag. And I just thank you for watching. God bless you and I will see you again soon. Take care, bye-bye.